You would not believe what they don't have in Costa Rica. One of the most basic things that you and I live with every day. We use it constantly. One of the things they do have is beautiful weather, very friendly people. They speak really nice Spanish, so I really recommend going to Costa Rica. So what do they not have there? They don't have street names or street addresses. And you might say, well, how do things work? But now you're not going to believe what does work there. So you're walking around and you ask people, what's the name of this street? And they'll say, oh, I don't know. Uh, how do you give directions? Oh, and they just give directions by pointing to things and talking about the, this white house, that blue whatever wall, and somehow they get around. But what does work, thankfully, is the GPS on your phone. Yeah, I know, it's weird. So they don't use street addresses or street names, but their GPS on your phone will work, thankfully. The problem is when you're living there, you need to speak Spanish because you're gonna have to get directions from people and the directions will be kind of, from your perspective, kind of complicated. It'll, it'll all be directions by recognizing visual cues. There will be no names of streets or anything like that. I was there just a day or two, and some of my friends who didn't speak Spanish needed help renting a house. So we called up the real estate place. I talked to them, and I'm thinking, how is this going to work? I, I don't know. I know very little. I just got there myself. But I knew where this, like, Walmart was. There was an equivalent of a Walmart, and I knew where that was. And so when I talked to the person, they immediately would start giving me directions. I said, wait, 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 wait. I know where the Walmart is. And so they had to give me directions from that. They would always have to start there. It was so funny. They would start there and they go, okay, start there, go out the front and then make a left, turn right, do this. And everything was from that perspective. But every time we made it to the house, we, we were able to look at a whole bunch of houses. My friends were able to uh, rent the house. It, it worked. But if you're going to Costa Rica, don't bother asking people what the name of the street is or where such and such street is. You can do it because I was curious. I wanted to, but they're just going to say, I don't know. And but they have no problem getting around, giving directions for them. It's no big deal. It's just it's amazing. But thankfully, the GPS on your phone works. So but make sure you brush up on your Spanish before you go. You really need to uh, be able to speak some Spanish when you're down there. But they do speak very nice Spanish. I hope you like this message. And I hope it helps you to avoid some problems. If you liked it, please subscribe, give a thumbs up. And uh, just remember to have the latest version of your GPS working on your phone.